glad that's over. Okay, so now we have to put on our goofy costume for this guy, right? We have to do... Oh, we have to go back to that scary lady and get, like, the trophy that she has or something, right? Because he said he did, like, a hook hand, right? So I have to get that... To take this trophy back. Because you're jealous. Oh, I have to be invisible. Okay. Um. Oh, do I confuse? Oh, hold on a second. Do I use the the new move? Oh, oh you're back to take away everything. Oh no, that was nope. She hates that being missing. So let's just steal it. My award? Trying to leave me. What the fuck? Just like everybody else. Back where you were, my old glory of How do I take it again? What do I do I kill her? Oh, oh. Oh. Do I telekinesis it? Do I give her another thing? That's not I'm pretty sure I need that for the costume, don't I? Oh, you take a um, okay, so, oh no, I'm like, are you going to make me go in her head? Let's go. Oh, if you don't like the performance, a simple boo will do. Oh God. She's like the mom from Shit's Creek. between a root canal and a sharp stick in the eye. Just ignore Jasper. He's just a critic. And if he happens to be right, I'll go talk to Benita. I'm sure all she needs is a little pep talk. That and acting lessons. You can get Benita to take the stage again. And you're... The star of my show, kid. After seeing how the combat upgrades work, I'm not really interested in collecting more figments. It just doesn't seem like they it does anything for you. Um, okay. So... Where's this gal's dressing room? Got a suitcase tag. That's what I need here. Got it. Hey, guess she really doesn't want to see anyone right now. Hey, watch it, or I'll call security. Excuse me, Miss Soleil. I heard you were feeling bad, so I just wanted to say that whatever you're going through, you're not alone. I used to be a performer myself, and I know how hard it is when... Kid, can't you see I'm trying to have a moment here? <laughs> Sorry. I was looking for Bonita Soleil. You mean the personal muse of Gloria Von Guten, her inner sunshine? The spirit of her youth, yes. That's me. What do you want, an autograph? I'm kind of busy here. So it's Dr. Girlfriend. I like that. They need you on stage right away for your big number. Am I not playing this right or something? I'm drowning in a quagmire of self-pity. Why aren't you getting that? Should I be doing more with my hands? 
So, you're not going out on stage? Have you seen any of the plays we put on here? Those god-awful slices of glorious, terrible life? How am I supposed to bring light to those? Listen, the burden of being the only sunshine in this theater is just too much for one beautiful, glowing, inspirational muse to bear, you know? So, who's that crying? Oh, sorry. Hey, can we kill the waterworks for a second? Thanks. It's a recording. It helps me focus. What the fuck? Is there any way I can get you to take the stage for the fans? If you can get me some help out there so I'm not the only light on the set. I'll turn on a spotlight. Uh, that could work. But you'll need a candle. Uh, I think there might be a spare in the storeroom. If you can get a candle into a spotlight and light it, I'll come out and give the show one last try. But I'm not promising anything. I'll leave you alone now. I know you have a lot of crying to do. Thank you. Now, where was I? <laughs> Glorious Cruel Training. Oh, she's at the hag at the home for girls. Oh, that sounds awful. Oh, God. Getting dropped off at the home for girls. <laughs> Getting whipped into ballet. Yeah. Yeah, just really just beating the, the arts into her. It's awful. Oh my god, this sounds like a- this looks like a terrible place. <laughs> Got it! Yep. <laughs> Everyone's cr around here is crying. Stop crying. I need the schema trunk tag for this guy. I need the schema trunk tag for this guy. Got the crandle for the candle. Oh, rank up. Okay, where do I put this fucking thing? Talk to the stagehand. Everything under control there, Becky? Ah! Why did you say that? What have you heard? Everything's fine! Except that our production has no- Everything under control there, Becky? Ah! Okay. Why did you say that? What have you heard? Everything's fine! Except that our production has no star. <laughs> oh, get up there. Maybe I should come back later when he's maybe I should come back later when he's not sleeping. Can't can't get a good grip. I wanna set him on fire. Can I set him on fire? Did game let me have fun and set him on fire? No. Stupid. It would be very funny. Whoa! Terrible. Look alive, people! Bonita Soleil is about to take the stage. Flower girls in position one. And action! Tonight I will be playing the part of Gloria von Guten, the famous actress. In this nostalgic memory of her breakthrough role in the smash hit musical Sunshine Shenanigans! <laughs> and where would Gloria be oh, no. without her muse? Her inner sunshine. 
the spirit of her youth. Play tonight, once again, by Bonita Soleil. Oh, I do so hope that my mother is proud of me. Not again. <gasps> the Phantom. I've seen some bad plays in my day, but this one's an actual menace. And it's all her fault. It's her bad acting that makes the Phantom strike. <laughs> this time, I'm going to file a formal complaint and get this theater shut down. Great. Well, I'm off to go kill myself. You know, Whoa. you could be a more constructive critic. Kid, if you want to see a good play, come talk to me. I've got a script here that'll knock them dead, I promise. Oh my hey. god. Whoa, 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 whoa! Careful! That's the manual mood override. That's how we set the right mood for the play. Mess with that, and we'll have happy plays on sad sets, sad plays on happy sets. Total chaos. Or worse. Improv. <laughs> so whatever you do, don't mess with the manual mood override unless you want to see some strange stuff happen. Oh, I want to see some Thanks strange stuff happen. I should go give her a peek. Gloria must be in a good mood now. Gloria, 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 Gloria must be in a good mood now. Can't get a good breath. Can't get a good breath. Can't get a good breath. Gloria must be in a good mood now. Gloria must be in a good mood now. Can't get a good breath. Gloria must be in a good mood now. Good boy. Woof, woof. Hey, hey, what part are you playing? I am playing the part of Gloria von Guten, once famous star of stage and screen. Yes. This is insane. Hey boy, whoa, whoa. Hey, what part are you playing? Well, I have a lot of walk-on bits. Oh, and sometimes I do the mailboat guy. It's a small part, but my agent says this is going to be my year. Hey, what part are you playing? Like, I am playing the part. Okay. Hey, what part are you playing? I am playing the part. Okay, I know that. I know that. Sing, buddy. Oh, God. This is Sonic the Hedgehog right here. This is Sanic, the Hedgehog. Um, yeah, with like the dogs last time, that was weird. This, this is a, this is, this is hilarious. It's a bunch of goofy, dumb kids putting on a play. It's all, it's the best ever. What the frig? Okay. So that changes the seed. Huzzah! Forsooth! What is the smell in the air? <laughs> Let us spin and be happy, entwined in this pole of love, forever young and twisty. Rejoice! For spring has beset in upon ourselves, and the spirit of May is a lingering! Yeah. Hooray! Maypole! 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 Maypoles are cool, man. I can dig on that. <coughs> Sorry, bud. Good boy. Ruff, ruff.
So what am I supposed to freaking do? Find a way up to the catwalks. I have to find. I have to fight the phantom. How do I get up to the catwalk? You're not scared of that phantom, are you? No, it's not him I'm frightened of. It's that fat one who clings to the side of the theater like a blood swollen tick sucking out its life. Ew. He's always been Ew, there, but David. he wasn't always that big and loud. I couldn't hear him much at all, really, until Gloria's mother hit the stage. He didn't like her performance either? No, I mean hit the stage, curse splat. Jump from the catwalks while Gloria was in Paris. Hmm. Yeah, that's what the janitor said, too. Oh, gosh. The show must Yeah, it must go on without me. As long as Jasper rolls and that phantom are out there. Sorry, kid. Sorry, kid. I'll leave you a Let's get up to these catwalks. Okay. Hey, can you help me get up to the catwalk so I can fight that phantom? Ah! Can't get there from here! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, unless you did that one particular play on that one particular set. Oh. But what am I saying? That's almost impossible. Forget about it. The theater is doomed. If you hate the show so much, why don't you just leave? Oh, I can't stop looking at it. It's like the sight of a horrible car accident. A car accident where the victims can't act and the paramedics forget their lines. Hey, why do you have to be so hard on Benita? I'm trying to save you from that mysterious phantom character. He only attacks when Bonita performs. If we got rid of little Miss Sunshine, we'd all be safer now, wouldn't we? I'm only thinking of the children. And the children. He's just trying to lighten things up around here. Ah! I've seen better shines on a shoe. She should quit now while she can still get a job as a nightlight. If you can't say something nice, don't say anything at all. The young boy's protests, though heartfelt, quickly lapse into simplistic and tedious platitudes. One and a half stars. All right, later you'll be... This play just stinks. Here, try this one instead. This play has some action in it. Some zing. Wow, thanks. Are you actually being nice? No, I'm just trying to keep myself halfway into taste. Go, give that to Becky and see if she Go. can find some actors. <coughs> give that to it. Becky with the good hair. This fucking... All right, come here, Becky. You said that if Benita performed, everything would be okay. Okay, so I left out the part about the deadly phantom. I thought you'd chicken out. Ma'am, I'm a psychonaut. Just show me how to get up to those catwalks he hides Ma out. Ma'am, who is an imaginary Sorry, no figure that well, you don't know what a psychonaut is because you're a figment of someone's imagination? We would lower this prop hot air balloon down from the catwalks and then pull it back up again. If you find it, or any other play for crying out loud, just bring it to me and I'll run the actors through it. We're so desperate for new material around here. Hey, what's this? A new script? Night of Joy. 
weird. It smells like popcorn, and it doesn't say which set to play it on. Oh, well, we'll just play it on whatever's on stage. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Huh. Here, you can be my first AD. Use the megaphone if you want to run the play again. Okay, new script, everybody. Let's practice. And action! Mother, mother, tell me true of the dad I never knew. He was brave in thought and deed. Can't you hear his mighty steed? Wow. Wow. Steed. Okay, what if I make that sad though? Can I change that into being sad? Becky, can you hear me? Must be out of range. Can't get a good grip. Or do I have to do it like Becky, can we see the night of joy again? Yeah, that one can use a little work. Mother, mother. Keep Daddy? <laughs> Funny. But now what do I do? Hey, what part are you playing? <sighs> I am playing the part of Gloria von Guten, what famous star of stage and screen. Guten. Ow! Oh, too rough! No! <laughs> Watch it! <laughs> Doing a great job, Becky! Aww. Oh my god, stop. Um, oh my god, that's just default just talking to her even if I put it away. Okay, stop. But it doesn't let me change... Like, I want to try running it again, but with a different mood light? Because she said it would be... It's happy and sad. Do I have to punch it? There we go. I did every way to interact with it, except for punching it. So now let's see what happens. Oh, there's a dragon! This is like dramatic now. We've got teeth now. The mail boat may never come, but I think I see the mail train approaching through yon tunnel. Mail train? Oh my god, you're dead. Ha ha ha! Tis a dragon indeed. You have been fooled and burned. Fooled and burned. <laughs> that was awesome. Whoa! I am hating this. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> I'm singing. That's awesome. I turn these kids evil. <laughs> Watch it. Watch it. Watch it. Okay, so now we should try the other one because I get hurt whenever I touch that dragon um so let's change the scene and see what this is like 
on this scene. Training in the theatrical disciplines. Wahaha! But I don't want to study theater! I want my mom to come take me home right now! Your mom has a career and a boyfriend to think about. She doesn't have time for an ugly little girl like you. Wow, relatable. <laughs> Nothing more tedious than the tears of an unlovable child. It's time to suffer for your art. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? That's so relatable. Oh my god. Watch it. Look at him spin. <laughs> That's so awesome. Why wow, you can barely see those posts against the background they chose for that uh that tree. It's funny. Hey, there's the hot air balloon I need to get to the catwalks. Now, if I could just get them to do a play that brings it down here, I could ride it up to the catwalks and take care of that phantom. <clears throat> but what play do I have a did I not give you the script yet? No, I only have these items Can I tell them to do that from up here with my cool megaphone that has a face? Huh, wait, wait, wait Oh, I I missed it. I wanted to. I want to see that again. Hold on. Yeah, that. We haven't seen it when they're mean. He was brave in thought and deed. Can't you hear his mighty steed? Yeah, just ride on by, Sir Deadbeat Dad. Don't hang around to help raise your poor daughter, Sir. Yeah. Yeah, fucking yeah. Oh my fuck. Wow. Okay, well let's talk to Becky again, I guess. Doing a great job, Becky. Doing a great job, Becky. Becky. <clears throat> Let's ask this guy what he thinks of the play, I guess. Doing a great job, Becky. Oh. Excuse me, Mr. Uh, you've tasted excellent. Oh. So now you're back begging for another bowl of quality theater. Not Not sure, but I think that if I find a play that moves the props around in just the right way, I can use them to get up to the catwalks and fight the phantom. No, but we're in a video game and Unfortunately for you, that's the last script I'll waste on this theater. Oh, I'm really? The rest for Broadway. <laughs> Just dig around the sets. I'm sure you'll find some horrible scripts in there. Oh, except, do not do that, because they certainly would not help you get to the catwalks. Which <laughs> are very dangerous anyway. So, give up. Give up. Look around the sets. Where? you be behind here hmm. 
Would you be in here where I can't see anything? Hmm. Can't see shit. Good thing my double jumps illuminate the area, like, and nothing else in the game does. I found the dang candle. So... Okay, nothing else here that I guess. Do you have a script that you like, dude? I'll leave you alone. Wait, what does she say if I say that? See, that performance is exactly what... Beat it, kid. As long as Jack... Okay. I'll leave you... Okay, okay, okay. The president gave me that to keep me quiet about our thing. Well, good thing I broke it, cause you, you're gonna, you're gonna stay there. Hmm. I gotta find a way to get up to the top of the set and get to that, through that second door. No, oh, I think I know where one might be. Oh my god, there's something up here. Wait, can I not... Is that not really up there? not see it. Yeah. 
there's something up there. But I don't know how to get up there. <clears throat> Dragon gone. Okay, nothing different. How the frig do I get up there? Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Where is there another door? This sucks. Can I get to it from over here, maybe? Like, I have to go back here? Are there different things accessible? You would think that there'd be like a place to climb up to like go to the other places. But I don't know what to do. Hmm. <laughs> Fire hydrant, it's awesome. one and a half stars <laughs> that's awesome <laughs> one and a half stars how am i gonna get past that dragon Select the power. Give me marksman, please. Wow, they all do a lot of damage. Which is super real. <laughs> okay, so what are you supposed to do with that dragon to get up there? There's a figment of imagination on its, like, head. But how do I not catch on fire going up there is the real question here. Um, do I have to use a confusion grenade on a prop? Or do I use telekinesis to move it? I guess I use telekinesis to move it. Maybe that makes sense. Hit, 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 hit. I slay thee with my mighty blast of Psy. Yon dragon is a mystical force of the theater. Only theater itself can affect it. Duh. Ha, ha, ha. Wait. Only the forces of theater can affect it. My mighty blast of Psy. Yon dragon is a mystical. Yon dragon. Only theater itself can affect it. Ha ha ha. Can't use that. Um. Good grip. Shield? No, it doesn't do shit here. Oh, I can set the dragon on fire. Yon dragon is a 
god dragon is a mystical force of the theater. Only theater itself can affect it. <laughs> Stop. That's really good. Says if I touch that model like at all. Wow. Okay. If I talk to you, you don't do anything. Um, there's no light anywhere except for when I double jump. power am I not thinking of here? Because I can't jump above them. Am I missing a platform? I can't... I can't get on the side of this ledge here. I could go like... that. Alright, let's try this one. Again. Oh, geez, Louise, look at that. Look how fast they are. It's wild. We watched it on... We watched it here, right? Have we not seen this in the sunny mood, though? Let's try this in, like, the good mood. I think we have. Yeah, we have. <laughs> sing, sing, birdie. La, la, la. Hit, hit Wee -wee. Wee -wee. Yay! Ha -ha. Wee -yay. Ha -ha. Oh, yay! We're going for a walk. Oh, my God. Okay, yeah, this is pretty confusing. I don't really know what to do here. <clears throat> Wait, can I ride? Yeah, no, I tried that. I tried riding my thing up there. All right, time to Google it. Okay. Um Watch the dragon get slain? But the dragon didn't get slain. What? <sighs> I 
Do I have to like not kill the kids or something? Give the script to Becky, then after the scene, go through the portal on stage to switch sets, which we did. Right? Yeah. Uh, switch the light. Use the megaphone to set the play to Night of Joy and watch the dragon get slain. Oh, do I have to kill the kids and then say run the play? We have to do it while the kids are here. He said with disappointment in his voice. Did not kill the kids. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. So did I just So I just forgot to hit, to hit the megaphone after we did Okay, there we go Cause I didn't know if this was like Cause sometimes okay. I was confused That was a simple fix And didn't spoil much what do you think you're doing? Oh, hey, I'm going to peck your eyes out. No, you're not. You're fucking dead. The day the mail boat finally came. God. All right. Becky. Oh, another script? The day the mail boat finally came? Mailboat! When it was never a vessel more beautiful and resplendified. Sorry, no mail for you, ugly girl. Wow! <laughs> In your face, fatty. What the fuck? That's awful. <laughs> oh god. Goodbye, Hag at the house. Balloon, moron! 
you moron! Hey, there's no magical balloon on this set, but that won't stop me from jumping down there and kicking your ass. So watch it. <laughs> what? Okay, so now I need to equip. Now I need to equip the megaphone and have them do the scene. Magical cloud? The fuck? Yeah, that one. Let's do this one but happy and see what happens. I say I believe I do see the mail boat approaching. Oh, it was never a vessel more beautiful and resplendified. Are you Miss Gloria von Guten? And bags of lavender scented fan mail must be for your beautiful self. Yay! Fan mail. When it comes, I want a whale. Okay, so there's no magic cloud, but we need to do the one with the... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where I climb up. Make those kids evil. so I can kill him. Oh god, look at those monsters! Got him. Okay, so then do I- I have them run it, right? What? Like... Oh, never mind. Damn it. Oh wait, did we do it? 
Ride the balloon up to the catwalks. Okay, I did it, but I accidentally skipped the scene. Where's the balloon? Okay, well, let's do the scene again, because I want to see how the balloon works. Because I'm dumb and I skipped it. So it's goodbye, Hagrid the Home. Oh, sigh. Whatever is wrong, little girl? Well, my family has left me alone in a bad, bad place for many years, and I don't know if they will ever come back for me. Oh, I don't worry. I'm sure they'll come for you, and you'll never have to think of that bad place. Yeah, again. I'm sure. I'm, sh I'm sure. Hey, you're right. I think I see them now. Hello, my dear beloved daughter. We have come back for you. Please come with us and be happy and never think of this terrible, terrible place again. Was I her dad? The deadbeat dad? Oh, I see. It's lowered now. I see. It's right there on the left. Okay. Wait, what? <clears throat> Hopefully this phantom boss fight is more fun than the lucha one. Wait, what the fuck? Am I supposed to go on it? Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, jeez. I don't think I like the idea of these spotlights. <laughs> this looks pretty cool. These this trapeze part is nice. Your mom's not welcome here, dude. Okay. Phantom of the Opera going on? Yeah? Oh, mother trucker, dude. Her like a butt on a stick. Watch your stick. Oh, it just put me back here? That's nice. Oh, God. Nice. Oh. Oh. What the? What the frig, dude? Okay. You are not Later, guys. What is even going on here? This is my sanctuary. Goofy. Goofy. Oh, okay. Don't use that there. Break a leg. Those are a pain. Ooh, this hat box needs a hat box now. Glorious Fallen Star. Gloria, Glory von Guten. Gloria, Glory alive. She's a big star. She's doing big star things. And then she was crying when she saw... Oh, her mother fucking killed herself. And then everyone started laughing at her because she was sad and she couldn't act anymore. And then she... F wow. Wow, this one's really relatable. You are not welcome here. 
This hat box needs a hat box tag. This is my Why would you put it right here? What is this gate? They really phoned it in these last few levels, I'm telling you. to save. will be your last. Can the character please grab the thing? That's really annoying. It's really annoying. Worked that time. Oh wait, do I have to do I have to wait again? Deuce, what is going on here? I'm so confused. I'm supposed to grind over here, right? No, no, no. Deaths aren't even from <clears throat> so on so these platforms are bouncing differently than other ones. So it's not even like yes, the player is Lord. being this is just bad. <laughs> there we go. Okay. And then So is the character not allowed to grab onto that thing there? Or am I expected to do this because there's a bag here? Like that seems like I just cheated. But I don't know. No, 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 no. Hey, wait, did I? Hip. 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 No. Hip. Hip. No. Hip. Okay, there they are. Hip. Nope. Back here. So now, what do I do again? Come up here. And then this guy's a fucking. I went invisible so that the light wouldn't see me, and the light still saw me. What the fuck? the candle and I'm gonna light shed light on him. Ah, cruel 
sunlight, anything but that. It's a oh, treacherous candle. Child. You shall pay for angering. The man. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Now just stay put so I can come punch and unmask you. What the fuck? Okay, Phantom, it's time to find out who you really are. Ha! Huh. I knew it was him. What? I fucking knew it. I totally guessed that. Uh-uh, you said it was Becky. Uh. Okay, the jig is up, Phantom. What? Why, I never! How dare you accuse me of being the rugged and romantic scoundrel that has thrilled and terrified audiences for years? Yeah, I guess you're right. He's so agile and limber and thin. He could never be you. Why, you? Of course it's me! Well, it's time to hang up the cape, Tubbs, because your days of terrorizing the theater as the Phantom are over. Maybe as the Phantom, but he's nothing compared to the full destructive force of an angry critic! <laughs> hmm, how can I say this and still sound cool? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me? Solid. Solid comeback. The pen is mightier than the sword. A whole lot of fat phobia in this game. 2005. <laughs> awesome. Love it. Look at this guy. What do I, what am I going to do? Okay, I got to get the candles and use the pyro. Conbrebus. Wait, where's the light at, you fucking nerd? Your fighting is weak, uninspired, and flat as a Not stale. <laughs> and I love his attacks, honestly. This dude is just Donald Trump. Not good enough. Not good enough. A terrible fight. Yeah. Not up to oh. the task at hand. Now, how can I just flick? Ah! Kill him. Get him. Wait, so instead of levitation, I should have. It'll kill all of the kids. Oh my goodness. Can I just jump and do levitation, please? Think, can I please? A terrible fighter, not up to the task at hand. Your moves are derivative and mechanical. Now, how can I light that candle? Horrible heart. 
Ocular agony. Oh, later, dudes. Gut him. Rip out his throat in front of those kids. He's dying? Okay, he's dying very dramatic. It is the theater. <laughs> and where would Gloria be without her youth? Yeah, get this sunshiny... The spirit of her youth. Get out there, queen. Sing. Right now. Sing. Say a word. Oh, you, you, that's awesome. They're so bright. You better listen to me. You're no good. This place stinks. It's worse than ever before. Oh, I can't believe you call this theater. I can't even see it from down here, but I know it's bad. Can you hear me? Oh, you've got fat arms, you hear me? Big fat arms like a wrestler. And a little tacky copper hanging from your neck. Ugh, your knees are ugly. And you snort when you laugh. <laughs> wow. Handsome, the spotlight is all yours. I believe I shall happily retire while I'm still young. Cool. Finally, we helped her. Recognition for my acting talents. What are you doing out here, Gloria? I can't remember the last time I came out here at night. It's so beautiful, isn't it? These plants could use a little water, though. Now, where's that hose? That's nice. The guy's gonna think I'm him because I'm wearing this. <laughs> it's very good. I have to reap it on my costume? Greetings, Dr. Lakota. Good to see your face. I see you're wearing your favorite jacket. If I may say so, your claw is looking especially menacing today. Up to the secret laboratory, then, is it? Hmm, is it? Yes. Yes, to the laboratory. Taking yourself this time, eh, Doctor? Less work for me. Inmate Look. Whitehead. Chief Orderly Bonaparte. You're... You're... Armed. Yeah. <laughs> Get him. Well, here I am. Up in the tower of an abandoned insane asylum. Wearing a straitjacket. Talking to myself. Okay, enough with the disguise. The things I do for Lily's brain. Well, if I'm going to get to the top of this thing, I'd better start hiking. Dude. Beep.